What's up, Conroe High? Today is Thursday, February 1st. I'm Michelle. And I'm Brielle. And today's show will be talking about Conroe's wrestling and softball teams. So stay tuned for today's episode of Total Recap. Our Conroe wrestling team has been working hard this season. Let's check out some interviews with the players. All right, I'm Joe. I'm here with wrestling. Benny. Benny Burton. All right, what got you into wrestling? Uh, just wanted to start a sport in high school my freshman year. All right. How long have you been in wrestling? Four years. It's my fourth year. Four years, long time. Do you want to pursue a career in wrestling? Uh, I want to. It's a little too late, though. It's my senior year. That's true. Did you get any offers? Yeah, I got one in Kansas, but my dad sent me a two past the deadline. Sorry. Oh, dude, okay. What does wrestling mean to you? Uh, it's just like community. You know, I have a lot of friends in wrestling. It's nice. I don't think I'd have as many friends if I wasn't in wrestling. That's good. Yeah, wrestling does bring a lot of people together. What advice would you give someone who wants to join wrestling? Uh, I'd say if you're going to join wrestling, just don't be too weird. I feel like that's all the wrestling people I know are all a little bit weird. Well, thank you so much, Benny. Uh, I would shake your hand, but you're all sweaty, so no thanks. But I'll see you, man. Fist bump. All right, I'm Joe. I'm also here with Victor. Victor, what got you into wrestling? Uh, I just wanted to do an individual sport. I saw wrestling, so I just chose it. Yeah, I get it. How long have you been in wrestling? Uh, this going, I've been wrestling for like a year and a half, so not, not too long. Okay, okay. Do you want to pursue a career in wrestling? Not really. It's just really fun, so I like it. Yeah, and you build lots of strength doing it. What does wrestling mean to you? Just a sport I like to do, just to get my mind off things. It's, it's just really fun, so. Wow, wow. No, nah, man, I, I totally see it, and you get to do it before and after school, so it's, it's, it's really fun. What advice would you give someone who wants to join wrestling? It's a really, like, physical and mental, like, hard, mentally hard sport, so you just gotta be prepared for that. Yeah, but it's good because you got that full body workout. Sure. All right, Victor, nice to meet you, nice man. To meet you. Have a good one. You too. One. Make sure you catch a match. Now, if wrestling isn't your sport, maybe softball is. Here's Addison and here's Addison and Leah to talk about their experience. Hello. Today on KTIG, I'll be interviewing Addison. All right. Hello, Addison. I'll be asking you a few questions. First of all, what got you into softball? Did someone inspire you, or were you trying out something new? I was just trying out something new because my mom saw a flyer on Facebook, I think, and she asked me if I wanted to join, and so I did. All right, so second question. Why do you continue to play softball instead of pursuing a different sport? because I feel like I've came like a long way, met like so many new friends from softball, so I just wanted to stick with it. All right, so what's your favorite memory from playing in softball? Probably hitting my first home run. Oh, that's very nice. Hello, today I'm interviewing... Aaliyah. Aaliyah. Uh, what got you into softball? Were you inspired or were you trying something new? Um, my mom just like threw me in and I didn't even want to play, so. Why do you continue to play softball instead of trying something else? Um, I've been playing it for a really long time, and I think I've put in a lot of work, so what's the point of coming all this way and not like sticking with it? All right. If someone were to ask you for some advice in softball, what would you tell them? Um, just keep working hard, go at it every day, and don't give up. All right. Now back to KTIG. Be sure to catch a game if you're interested. We will now take you to a quick commercial break. Look, he's not wearing his ID. Where's his ID at? He's finna get caught. Whoa, young man. Where's your ID? 
You can Naples have one, right? I'm sorry, dude. I didn't know. Come with me. Hello, Conroe. I'm Jonathan here with your weather today. Today we will, will be partly cloudy with a high of 71 and a low of 51. Tomorrow we'll have an isol isolated thunderstorms with a high of 71 and a low of 57. And Saturday thunderstorms will continue with a high of 68 and a low of 49. And on Sunday will clear up and be sunny with a high of 67 and a low of 48. Finally, Monday will be a par partially cloudy with a high of 64 and a low of 43. And fun fact of the day, while Napoleon may be considered short today, his height was typical for the average Frenchman in the 19th century. Now back to Michelle in the studio. Now let's take a look at our special segments for today. What's up guys, this is KTG staff member of the month. Hello. I'm gonna ask you some questions. What did you job at KTG? So my actual job is a total recap anchor, but that has not been happening a whole lot. So instead I've been hosting game time recently and it's a lot of fun. Do you think you're better than both markers? In an honest sense, I'd say at shows, probably better at some of them, but editing, no. I hate editing. Okay. What is your greatest achievement IQ that you see? So last year, I was promoted to Cooking with Culinary producer, and I thought that was pretty cool. I did not do so well at it, as well as I thought, but hey, it was great to give it a shot. It was a nice step up for a little bit, but this year, I'd have to say hosting my first game time was a really great achievement. If you can make changes to things that go on KTS, what would they be? No. Okay. What then your current position with other job would you like to have? Um, well, since my uh, listed position is Total Recap Anchor, and I've only anchored for three shows, two officially, I think I'd actually take on Game Time Host, if I'm honest. How has your senior year at case actually been going? Well, good. Nothing to complain about. Good friends here. I, I like it. That, that's it. Okay. What do you have planned after high school? So after high school, I ain't going to college. I ain't, I ain't finna pay those student loans. So joining the military where I can get my education for free, doing the Air Force. Kind of excited. Nah, it's. <laughs> what would you say to someone who's interested in joining k -Tay? Do it. Please do it. We need more creative minds on KTIG. Not to say everybody here sucks, but sometimes the creativity does get down a few days. We need more energetic people. We need that energy on KTIG. Please do it if you are interested. It's fun. Okay, that's it. Back to the studio. We're going to take one more quick break. Trip me? Yeah, hey, what you gonna do about it? I was not in the fight. What are you talking You're about? You're still reporting the fight, and that's not okay. Come on. Even recording fights can get you ISS, OSS, and if you keep doing it, can get you even worse punishments. To turn into all of our upcoming shows, tomorrow we have KTIG9, on Tuesday we have Polo Talk, and then on Wednesday we have Total Recap, so make sure to tune in. Also CHS, remember to walk and talk and stay to the right. Thanks for turning into today's episode. Total, a total recap. Make sure to keep up with us on KTIG, Instagram, KTIG News, or on our website at KTIGnews.com. 
Make sure to, to subscribe on our YouTube channel and click the bell to get notifications so you don't miss any KTIG shows. And remember, CHS, all, all tigers, tigers achieve. achieve.